is the discovery that has everyone puzzled and asking the same question. What was found at Detroit's wastewater treatment plant? It looked like it might be a body part. Well, now police and the medical examiner's office are working to get answers. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell is outside the medical examiner's office right now. So, Kim, what have you learned tonight? Well, this is an, a mystery that started on Friday. That's when workers at the Detroit Water Resource Recovery Facility saw something suspicious in the water. It was in a screening area where they screen the water, get all the debris out of it so it can be treated. It looked like maybe a body part. Now the medical examiner's office confirms it is some kind of tissue. The question is, is it human or not? Detroit police tell 7 Action News they responded to the scene and carefully picked up the object. You could hear questions between dispatchers and police on the scanner. Was it an organ? Was it a heart? The answer? No one could tell what it was. Today there are still questions. The Wayne County Medical Examiner's Office tells 7 Action News right now they are working to find out what it is. At this point, they don't even know if it is human or animal tissue. A sample will be sent out for testing. The results will determine the next step. So the medical examiner has sent out tissue to a lab to be tested, but the medical examiner's office says these labs, they have a lot of work to do and they have to prioritize as they do their testing. So because this may not be anything criminal, it could be an animal part that was simply somehow in the sewage system. It may not be prioritized, so it's possible it could take months before we have answers, but a lot of people have questions tonight as to what was that the water plant. Reporting live, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. All right, I guess it's going to take a while. Thank you so much, Kim, for the live report.